Ladies and gentlemen, buddies and pals, <laughs> hello. If your eyes aren't as glued to the screen as much as mine are, then you probably haven't heard that Twitch streamers' revenues have recently been shared on a little board site known as 4chan, home of the home of the frogs. <laughs> uh, the little froggers left a note for passerbyers, and um, you know, just trying to reach out to their good friend Bezos. It's kind of a nice message here. We bring to you. Today, an extremely Poggers League. Twitch is an American video live streaming service that focuses on video game live streaming, including broadcasts of eSport competitions operated by Twitch Interactive, a subsidiary to Amazon, blah, blah, blah. Their community is also disgusting cesspool. So to foster more disruption <laughs> and, and competition on the online video streaming space, yes, please, I hope you succeed with this. We have completely pwned them. Ugh. <laughs> I get it. I get what they're doing there. And in, in one, in part one, are releasing the source code for almost 6,000 internal Git repositories, including security measures, all of this is just pretty much everything. An unreleased Steam competitor from Amazon Game Studios. So there's gonna be a Amazon Steam. Ugh. <laughs> Good luck with that, boys. Many who've tried. Twitch SOC Eternal Red teaming tools, lol, and creator payout reports from 2019 until now. Find out how much your favorite streamer is really making. Torrent of 128 gigs and a magnet that I'm gonna have to blur out because I don't want to get taken out. Jeff Bezos paid 97 million for this. We're giving it away for free. <laughs> Hashtag do better Twitch. Now, now I do feel bad for some of them. Um, some people like to be more private, even, and they might not even been unforthright about how much money to make, because it's, a lot of the followers and subscribers you can actually see on the channels. Critical said this, if you multiply, it's, um, essentially you get $3.50 per subscriber, not including the different tiers or whatever. If you just uh, multiply 3.5 by the amount of subscribers they have, plus you just add in, like, you know, maybe, depending on the the stream size a certain amount of donations with um bits and tips um you can kind of get a rough estimate which is still probably pretty low because you're not including like sponsorships what i find interesting is how many people were surprised that streamers make this much money oh my favorite streamer seems so humble and he talks about you know revolution for the poor and are they champion you know redistributing wealth but now he makes billions and millions and millions and millions and millions and millions of dollars while i sit here and eat my cup of noodles <laughs> anyways but here's the thing only made this is like the one percent of streamers streamers don't make this much on average yeah if you're like a moderate streamer you can still make good money but like good luck getting there it's not an easy game streaming it's it's easy once you get in but it's extremely difficult for you to get in there's like the gate to entry there what i find hilarious is if <laughs> some of the streamers being absolutely crucified <laughs> uh, you know and i do feel for them but some of these comments man <laughs> they're a little too funny Here's some of my favorites. The grossly affluent is a moral obscenity and our economic system inevitably leads to oppressive and exploitative power hierarchies. Redistribution is the only ethical option. Uh, but now that I think about it a little more clearly, is a man not in the sweat of his brow? I think I heard that in a video game once. And you know, I'm he did the yeah, wait for is this. It, that is literally like, is a man not entitled to the sweat of his brow? Is a Bioshock Andrew Ryan reference that is supposed Dude. to be libertarian, right? The but actually, it <laughs> is a living meme. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my health. I'm too old for this. <laughs> Dude. <laughs> Bro. You're the live you you've become the meme dude. Oh man. Twitter finding out streamers make money online. Hassan. Other millionaire streamers. <laughs> so good, dude. True! True! There we go. 
Uh, there is one post I actually got physically upset about. I'm just gonna read this over for you. Ready for a dramatic reading. Mm. Actual. Fee fi fo fum. Fee fi. <clears throat> the leaked Twitch payouts should honestly be an eye opener in a conversation about robbery Twitch does to their creators. Taking 50% of majority's pay is wild, and we don't nearly make as much as viewers think we do. And before some dusty Dorito person comes rolling in here, like, you don't think 50% is a fair? You're ungrateful. Like, firstly, sh shut the fuck up. <laughs> we work our asses off and are quite literally the backbone. So yeah, taking half of our hard-earned work is bullshit. Also, before someone else wants to just tell me to leave Twitch, like, having to rebuild everything you worked so hard for is devastating. Should it should not be your answer. Ask yourself. Why you're so butter over other streamers getting what they deserve? My dude! You... You are... The king, the queen, the, uh, the, uh, majesty. <laughs> you're the majesty of being in the- saying the wrong thing at the absolute worst time. If you wanna, perhaps, say, like, smaller creators are being disenfranchised are taking way too much money that would have been better and i think that's what you meant i hope because otherwise this is so disconnected and coming from from point of privilege based on these leaks these leaks are absolutely gigantic are you talking about the top creator makes 752k a month a month my friend why would you think that would be, the take would be that we aren't getting paid enough? That this is the conversation to take. And what they like, they're like you know, I'm not one to virtue signal, but the level of like, I don't even know how you can say that with a straight face. You like, <laughs> what? Yeah, if you want to say lower streamers aren't getting paid enough, yes, probably. Like you know. I think you should do these entertainment things as fun. Um, I think you should always have a plan. And if things don't go the way you want, you have to be ready. It's happened to me many times. Uh, working, you know, many jobs. These things just happen in life and you just have to roll with it. But, um, man, this is like incredible. From September, August uh, 2019 to October 2021. Number, what, 75 on the list made a million dollars within roughly a year. Like, don't get me wrong, these are still the 1%. The lowers do not make this much. Be good, good luck, good luck, if you think you're going to. Like, it's good luck. I wish the best for you. Anybody could do what they put their mind to, but oh man. But like, yeah, a hundred number 100 of the top payouts get 886k it's absolutely insane and then you have the nerve to come in here and say after all these leaks to say that we they are we as streamers aren't getting paid enough wrong wrong place wrong time why would you even think that was a good take to make at that moment it's just a bad take at that it's the worst take it is like read the room get out of the room don't ever come back to the room. <laughs> I'm sorry, dude. That was bad. Um, what was um, a little bit more concerning was uh, the protective ban list. So it has finally been confirmed. People have argued about this day in and day out. But then this ban list came out and absolutely confirmed the obvious that I don't even know how people could say that there aren't protected classes on the website. Of First of all, of course there are. If you are a high stake employee and contribute a lot to the site, you're going to get higher privilege. That's just anywhere. Go anywhere, work any place. If your job requires higher output for the company, they're gonna protect you. This is just how, I don't know how to, this is economics. This is like basic corporate uh, work. I'm sorry to tell you. It's the world we live in, you know, may not be the best for everybody, but it is what it is. Amazon's has been fully stretched open. 
and they weren't even given chocolate as some comfort food. <laughs> oh man, so this is only part one. I, I have thoroughly enjoyed this. I do love a good fire, good bonfire to huddle around, even if it's somebody else and not on my accord. <laughs> but um, yeah, I can't wait for part two. And by the way, I saw what you guys did to the Dylan page on Twitch. 